We're back with some more NFL action here for Christmas Day. I got a game I want to take a look at on today's card, so let's jump right into it. Now, the Packers head to Miami to take on the Dolphins here to kick things off on Christmas. The Packers come into this game as the 20th overall team in the Hot Tibet Power Ranking. The Dolphins are the ninth overall team. You know, for the Dolphins, fall to the Bills last Saturday night in the snow. Couldn't quite pull that one off as far as the Packers go. You know, get the, the pretty impressive win over the Rams on Monday Night Football. And it's a Packers team and a Dolphins team, for that matter, who have been fairly interesting this season. I mean, the Packers have certainly had some struggles on the season, but Aaron Rodgers has still look solid you know over 3,000 yards passing for him 23 touchdowns on the year Aaron Jones has been decent in the rushing game 937 yards on the season for him um, hasn't done you know a, a ton as far as scoring only two touchdowns on the year for him but you know Dylan's been up there as well two solid rushers for the Packers Alan Lazard has obviously had a decent season receiving 627 yards for him and overall the Packers offense isn't terrible and they've certainly had some bright spots certainly have had some good games but overall only putting up 20.5 points per game compare that over the Dolphins who um, offensively have struggled a little bit as of late in certain spots but overall have been a strong team on the offensive side of the ball um, you know Tua has looked pretty good this season 2300 yards and 24 touchdowns on the year for him Tyree Kill and Jalen Waddle pretty much make up for everything I mean probably the strongest duo in the NFL this season both over a thousand yards receiving combined um, you know seven touchdowns for both of them Raheem Moser has also been a strong strong rusher with 740 49 yards on the season and offensively it's just a Dolphins team that can move the ball down the field and can score some points putting up 24.6 points per game um, you know when it comes to the defensive side of things these two teams have really been pretty comparable Packers giving up 24.6 points per game the Dolphins are also giving up 24.6 points per game but coming off of last week's performances you know the the win for the Packers on Monday Night Football the loss for the Dolphins um, on Saturday I think we kind of see a reversal here I think the Dolphins at at home here in this game come ready to play um, I think Tua, Tyree Kill, Jalen Waddle all show up in this game put on a performance for this offense and really I think the Packers offense is just not going to have enough answers to keep up in this game taking the Dolphins minus four here against the Packers